What's good, YouTube? It's your boy, Blue Blood Sports TV, back at y'all with another one. So, we got some breaking news. As two-time Olympic gold medalist, three-division world champion, former unified lightweight world champion, Ukrainian superstar boxer, Vasil Hitek Lomachenko has decided that he is going to turn down the opportunity to come home, well, to stay home, right? And to come train in the United States rather than staying in the Ukraine to help defend his country in their unfortunate situation with Russia. So Vasil Hitek Lomachenko was offered the opportunity to face off against newly crowned, undefeated, unified, lightweight world champion, Australian star boxer, George Cambosis Jr. With that said, Lomachenko, 16 wins, two losses, no draws, 11 wins by way of knockout, 33 years of age, uh, five foot six with a 66 inch arm reach. He has now uh, turned down the opportunity to face off against George Cambosis Jr. He will stay, uh, remained in the Ukraine, okay? And he will uh, uh, turn, uh, he will forego the opportunity that has been granted to him because uh, he petitioned according to, uh, um, according to uh, reports, Vasil Lomachenko and his team, they have petitioned, you know, uh, the Ukraine to be able to allow him to be pardoned and excused so he can come back to the States and train and help prepare himself for a June 5th showdown with George Cambosis Jr. With that said, he's turned down the opportunity. He's informed him that he is now going to stay uh, in uh, the Ukraine. He's going to now, you know, uh, um, stay focused on what's taking place there. And now George Cambosis Jr. and his promoter and his team have offered undefe undefeated WBC lightweight world champion, superstar boxer, Devin the Dream Haney, the fight for June 5th uh, in Australia. It's going to be a two-fight deal. Uh, it will be an undisputed showdown. And now uh, Devin Haney, undefeated WBC lightweight world champion, superstar boxer, 27 wins, no loss and no draw, 15 wins by way of knockout, Five foot eight with a 72 inch arm reach at 23 years of age. George Cambosis Jr. is uh, 20 wins, no loss, and no draw. 10 wins by way of knockout. He is 28 years of age, five foot nine and a half with a 69 inch arm reach. So Devin Haney will be facing off against George Cambosis Jr. June 5th. Uh, George Cambosis' team officially um, made the offer now to Devin Haney and his team uh, uh, to father, trainer, manager, and CEO Bill Haney. Uh, Matchroom, Matchroom CEO and promoter Eddie Hearn, who uh, co-promotes Devin Haney and the platform he fights is the zone. Uh, so now Eddie Hearn, uh, and you can expect them to, you know, uh, um, uh, uh, you know, finalize this deal, and it's going to be Devin Haney versus George Cambosis Jr. June fifth in Australia. As I told you guys, right? I told you guys I didn't believe that. I thought that at the end of the day, you know, uh, I thought that. Uh, George Cambosis Jr. and Vasil Lomachenko fight was not going to come to fruition. Okay. I thought that, you know, um, you know, the politics and the sport of boxing and everything that comes with it uh was not gonna was gonna be superseded by circumstances, okay? And the fact that uh Lomachenko is in the Ukraine, he has an unfortunate set set of circumstances. Uh I thought it was uh um unruly for uh him to volunteered to go over to Ukraine to help defend, uh, you know, 18 to 60. They had, uh, if you are the male, 18 to 60, you had to stay in uh, the Ukraine to help defend uh, from the un unfortunate uh, set of circumstances. And the fact that, you know, uh, Lomachenko petitioned to be uh, pardoned and excused to allow him to train for a boxing match, uh, that didn't sit well with me, okay? Uh, many people call Lomachenko a hero, okay? Uh, and so with that said, I thought that Lomachenko, you know, should should stay. And on top of it, I thought that um, Devin Haney deserved the opportunity to fight for undisputed. OK, point blank and period, because he's earned this opportunity. Uh, Vasil Lomachenko, he's had plenty of opportunities. OK, he his first three fights as a world champion, he fought for uh, world titles. When he was one in one, he got the opportunity to fight for a world title. And I thought that, you know, uh, this is the time where Devin Haney should get the opportunity to fight for 
a world title, okay? Uh, a unified world title, an opportunity. Lomachenko fought for unified. He fought for undisputed. He came up short against Teofimo Lopez, okay? And I thought that uh, it was time now for Devin Haney to get his opportunity, okay? I made no secret about that. Uh, and so now I stated that, you know, I thought that, you know, things was going to work out in the way that uh, the unfortunate set of circumstances is going to stand in the way of uh, um, Teofimo Lopez, excuse me, George Cambosis Jr. fighting Vasil Lomachenko. And I was 1000% correct. As uh, now you can see that Lomachenko has decided that he is going to stay in the Ukraine. He's not going to uh, look to uh, uh, compete against George Cambosis Jr. Uh, he's going to stay back and he's going to look to uh, uh, still stay and defend his uh, country. So with that said, that's all I got for y'all. Make sure you hit the like button. Drop a comment in the comment section. Let me know what y'all think. Y'all already know what it is. It's your boy, Blue. Blue Blood Sports TV. Hate, like, comment, and subscribe. You haven't subscribed, hit the subscribe button. Hit the like button. Hit the bell icon to get all the new notifications. Follow me on Instagram at Blue Blood Sports TV. All one word. Y'all already know what it is. Shout out to the entire LDBC. Shout out to New Media. Shout out to Black Media Row. Make sure you like and share these videos. That's all I got for y'all. December 5th, George Cambosis Jr. versus Devin the Dream Haney. Vasil Lomachenko has now turned down the opportunity to face off against um, George Cambosis Jr. He's now opting to stay in, although he's been granted, you know, the opportunity to leave and participate and compete against uh, George Cambosis Jr. in Australia June 5th which will be June 4th uh, here in the States. It's going to be June 5th in Australia. Um, he's turned down the opportunity. He's instead uh, opted to stay in his country and defend the soil that he stands on. So let's see how everything unfolds and plays out. But that's all I got for y'all. Make sure you hit the like button. Drop a comment in the comment section. Let me know what y'all think. Y'all already know what it is. It's your boy, Blue. Blue Blood Sports TV. Hate, like, comment, and subscribe. If you haven't subscribed, hit the subscribe button. Hit the like button. Hit the bell icon to get all the new notifications. Follow me on Instagram at Blue Blood Sports TV. All one word. Y'all already know what it is. Shout out to the entire LDBC. Shout out to New Media. Shout out to Black Media Row. Make sure you like and share these videos. That's all I got for y'all. Peace.